Churros, get your churros! Tenderly roasted and warm. Pásale, pásale, pásale. Come on in, come on in, come on in. Get your churros. Did you catch him this morning? Siempre. Gracias. También calentitos. Salud. Salud. several cities and cultures in Southern California. More than 100 street vendors shut down in recent weeks as police crack down on panic. Many vendors, unable to afford brick and mortar stores, have been forced off the street and so forced to abandon their cultural traditions of serving food to their communities. Next after the break, we go to Good job. <laughs> Thank you. It's coming along. Mm -hmm. Next time I need bigger pieces. I'll get you bigger pieces. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm leaving. I'm a little late. Okay. Sit. I haven't seen him in a while. Por si el caso. All right. Love you. Love you too. <laughs> started with my grandfather, my abuelo over there in Zacatecas, Mexico. He used to use this special wheel <laughs> to herd the sheep and, you know, and goats in Zacatecas. And, uh, well, I want to keep the tradition alive here and uh, it's my it's, uh, culture, you know? The sound of his whistle is nostalgic for me. I'm reminded of my home and my family in Mexico. They were known to talk to each other in this way. The whistles are a part of our roots. It is a language that is dying out, but he keeps it alive. The Chiro Man reminds me of my childhood. In mi niñez, the paleteros would pass by. Oh, and the pork grain chip vendors, those are so good. I hope that in the future, there are more people like the Chiro Man. And I hope that one day, hearing a whistle will bring back childhood memories of Boyle Heights for my baby sister.